Bristol Community College, Mathematics with Dan Avedikian, Math 119, Fundamental Statistics, Section 5.1, Problem 3. This is Section 5.1, Problem Number 3. It says, Thirsty Eddie has a special beer fridge next to his favorite TV watching chair. Eddie's not married. Imagine that. Inside the fridge, there are eight Coronas, 12 Heinekens, four Becks, and 21 Bud Lights. Let's say Eddie reaches in the fridge one day while watching the Patriots game and randomly grabs a beer without ungluing his eyes from the screen. What is the probability that he winds up grabbing a Corona, Heineken, Becks, Bud Light, or Guinness? So, first, what you need to do to answer these questions is figure out how many beers there are in the fridge altogether. So if we add 8 Coronas plus 12 Heinekens, that's 20 beers. Uh, plus 4 Becks is 24, plus another 21 Bud Light is 45. So altogether, there's 45 bottles of beer in the fridge. Eight of those 45 bottles are Corona. So the probability that when he reaches in, he gets a Corona would be 8 over 45. Now, <clears throat> that doesn't reduce that well. You can turn it into a decimal or a percent if you like by doing 8 divided by 45. Now, you don't have to. 8 over 45 is fine. Um, part B, Heineken. <clears throat> What's the probability that when he reaches in the fridge without looking that the beer he gets is a Heineken? Well, altogether there's 12 Heinekens out of 45 beers total in the fridge. So it would be 12 over 45. That does reduce if you want to. You can cut it by 3. 3 goes into 12 4 times, and 3 goes into 45 15 times. Um, you could turn it into a decimal or a percent if you want. You could do 4 divided by 15. Or 12 divided by 45 should give you the same answer. But you can just stop at 12 over 45 if you like. Backs. What's the probability that it reaches in without looking and he gets a backs? Well, there are four bottles of Becks in the fridge out of 45 beers altogether. So the probability that the beer he gets without looking is a Becks is 4 over 45. That doesn't really reduce. You could turn it into a decimal the same way, not 4 over 15 this time, but 4 divided by 45, and you get a decimal, or you can make it a percent. 40, 4 over 45 is fine, though. How about a Bud Light? There's 21 of those out of 45 beers altogether. So the probability that the type of beer he gets without looking as a Bud Light would be 21 over 45, which again can be left like that. This also could be reduced by 3. 3 goes into 21 7 times. 3 goes into um, 45 15 times. So that's almost 50%. Again, if, if you like decimals or percents better, you can divide it out with your calculator like that, but you don't have to. Now, E is a little bit more interesting. Guinness. There's no Guinness in the fridge, so it's impossible that he reaches in the fridge and comes out with a Guinness if there is none. So the probability for part E would be zero. It's impossible.